Our sun, the lifeblood of our solar system, is a dynamic star. It pulsates with energy, constantly changing and evolving. This celestial dance is punctuated by periods of heightened activity known as solar maximums. In October 2024, Earth's premier space agency, NASA, confirmed a significant event. Our sun has entered a new solar maximum. This period is marked by increased energy, more frequent solar storms, and a profound impact on our planet. The solar maximum is not a sudden event but a gradual intensification of the sun's activity. It's a time when sunspots proliferate across the solar surface, and solar flares erupt with greater frequency. These events are not just visually stunning but carry real consequences for our technology-dependent world. As we journey through this solar maximum, understanding its dynamics becomes crucial. The more we know about the sun's behavior, the better we can prepare for its effects on our planet and our way of life. The sun's activity is governed by a fascinating dance of magnetism. Every 11 years, the sun undergoes a magnetic flip, its north and south magnetic poles switching places. This flip coincides with the solar maximum, amplifying the sun's energy output. Sunspots, those dark, cooler regions on the sun's surface, are visual indicators of intense magnetic activity. These regions are the birthplaces of solar flares, sudden bursts of energy that release radiation across the electromagnetic spectrum. Another dramatic manifestation of solar maximum is coronal mass ejections, or CMEs. These are massive eruptions of plasma and magnetic fields from the sun's corona, carrying billions of tons of charged particles into space at incredible speeds. These energetic particles propelled by solar flares and CMEs interact with Earth's magnetic field, triggering geomagnetic storms. These storms can disrupt our technologies from power grids to satellites highlighting the interconnectedness of Earth and its star. The current solar maximum has wasted no time in announcing its arrival. In August 2024, a staggering 299 sunspots were observed on the sun's surface, a number unseen in over two decades. This surge in sunspot activity foreshadows a potentially potent solar maximum. One event in particular has captivated scientists and sky watchers alike. In May 2024, a colossal sunspot, designated AR3664, unleashed a barrage of powerful solar flares and CMEs. This solar tempest slammed into Earth's magnetic field, triggering the strongest geomagnetic storm in over 500 years. More recently, on October 3, 2024, an X9-0 solar flare erupted from the sun. This intense burst of X-ray radiation classified as the most powerful category of solar flares caused radio blackouts across the sunlit side of Earth and triggered a G4 geomagnetic storm. The storm's effects were felt globally, with reports of disrupted GPS signals and stunning auroral displays visible even at lower latitudes. These events, while captivating, serve as stark reminders of the sun's raw power and the potential impact it can have on our planet. The recent solar events, while significant, are not unprecedented. History whispers tales of even more powerful solar storms that have left their mark on Earth. The most famous, the Carrington event of 1859, serves as a stark reminder of the sun's potential fury. During the Carrington event, a massive solar flare and CME unleashed a geomagnetic storm of unimaginable intensity. Telegraph systems worldwide went haywire, with some operators reporting electric shocks and fires. Auroras, typically visible only near the poles, danced in the skies as far south as the Caribbean. In 1921, the New York Railroad storm caused widespread electrical disruptions across the northeastern United States highlighting the vulnerability of power grids to solar storms. Decades later, in 1989, the Quebec blackout plunged millions into darkness. A stark demonstration of our continued susceptibility to the sun's whims. These historical events serve as a stark reminder that while the sun gives life, it can also disrupt the delicate balance of our technological civilization. The impacts of solar maximum extend far beyond dazzling auroral displays. The Earth is enveloped in a delicate magnetic bubble, our first line of defense against the sun's wrath. But during solar maximum, this shield is tested like never before. When CMEs collide with Earth's magnetic field, they trigger geomagnetic storms. These storms can induce powerful currents in long conductors, such as power grids, potentially leading to widespread blackouts. The 1989 Quebec blackout stands as a stark reminder of this vulnerability. 
satellites orbiting high above Earth also face the brunt of solar maximum. The increased radiation can damage sensitive electronics, disrupt communication signals, and even shorten a satellite's lifespan. The GPS systems we rely on for navigation are also susceptible to interference during geomagnetic storms. While the impacts on technology are significant, it's important to remember that solar maximum poses no direct threat to human life on Earth. Our atmosphere protects us from the harmful radiation associated with solar flares and CMEs. As we venture further into the digital age, our reliance on technology deepens, making us more vulnerable to the vagaries of space weather. However, by understanding the risks posed by solar maximum, we can take steps to mitigate its impacts. Power grids, the backbone of modern society, are particularly susceptible to geomagnetic storms. By reinforcing grid infrastructure, implementing early warning systems and developing strategies for controlled power outages, we can minimize the disruption caused by solar events. Satellites, vital for communication, navigation, and scientific observation, can be hardened against radiation and equipped with redundant systems to enhance their resilience. Spacecraft missions can also be timed to avoid periods of peak solar activity minimizing exposure to harmful radiation. By investing in research developing advanced forecasting models and implementing protective measures, we can navigate the challenges posed by solar maximum and safeguard the technology that sustains our modern world. Scientists around the world are closely monitoring the current solar maximum, working diligently to unravel its mysteries and predict its potential impacts. Their insights provide valuable guidance as we navigate this period of heightened solar activity. The sun is a complex and dynamic star, explains Dr. Sarah Gibson, a solar physicist at the National Center for Atmospheric Research. Solar maximum is a natural part of its cycle, and while it presents challenges, it also offers incredible opportunities for scientific discovery. Dr. David Hathaway, a retired NASA scientist who spent decades studying the sun, cautions against complacency. The Carrington event reminds us that the sun is capable of producing far more powerful storms than anything we've experienced in modern times. We must be prepared for the unexpected. The insights of these experts underscore the importance of continued research, international collaboration, and public awareness as we navigate the challenges and opportunities presented by the solar maximum. Solar maximum often sparks fear and speculation, fueled by misconceptions and misinformation. It's essential to separate fact from fiction to approach this natural phenomenon with clarity and understanding. One common myth is that solar maximum causes global warming. While the sun is the primary driver of Earth's climate, the increase in solar radiation during solar maximum is minimal and does not significantly contribute to the long-term trend of global warming. Another misconception is that solar flares can directly harm humans on Earth. Our atmosphere acts as a shield, absorbing the harmful radiation from solar flares. While astronauts in space are more vulnerable, they are protected by spacecraft shielding and mission planning. By debunking these myths, we can foster a more informed and reasoned understanding of solar maximum, allowing us to focus on practical preparedness and scientific discovery. The solar maximum, a celestial spectacle that has unfolded over millennia, is a reminder of our intimate connection to the cosmos. While it presents challenges, it also offers opportunities for scientific exploration and technological innovation. By studying the sun's behavior, we can improve our ability to predict space weather and mitigate its impacts on our technology-dependent world. Investing in research, developing early warning systems, and strengthening infrastructure are crucial steps in safeguarding our technological civilization. As we journey through this solar maximum and beyond, we must remember that we live in a dynamic and interconnected cosmos. Understanding and respecting the sun's rhythm is not just a scientific endeavor, but a matter of ensuring the resilience and sustainability of our technological civilization. So hit that subscribe button, ring the bell for notifications, and let's turn the page on a new adventure together. Get ready to experience books like never before. Only on VBook 360 like, comment, and share to support the channel and keep the video magic alive. Thank you for stopping by. And remember, every video has a story, and every story deserves to be shared. See you in the next video.